so I wanted to show a little update to this guy here. Um, I've just done a few other pages. I've, you know, I've been working through it. So these are the pages. You know, you've already seen them. Um, Oops, sorry, bump there. So you know, I've seen that. I'll go through again at some point. I think I don't know what I did to the last one, but the the colour on it was a bit off. So I've just been. This has been like I said, my section about myself. So I need to add more in here because I've just realised that you know, I actually have three sisters, but I've only put one in here. So I need to add some more. Of family stuff and some you know ancestors and that sort of thing so i want to start doing more ancestral magic uh, a tarot reading i had by kellyanne maddox many years ago this is um books that i absolutely love these are my two favorite series is realm of the elderlings now i loved uh kellyanne maddox's rebel witch book when she was saying that you can actually take you know your favorite books and um use them to make your own kind of spells and things she i think she said she uses narnia i thought well that is an absolute wonderful idea this one because it's black jewels i'd probably use this for maybe crystal magic i'm not that good with crystal magic crystals don't really call to me but i love this series this one here is realm of the elderlings so that is very much um the wit is a big magic system in that which is speaking to animals because we have the lovely little night eyes there one of the best animal characters i've ever read about if not the best to be honest so anyway that was that i've got uh i want to put a lord of the rings one in here and i also have this be your own warrior princess because i was a big xena fan so this is like an affirmation be your own warrior princess so this is the latest one i've put in is um moon hair this is in the season of the crone section and this is all about loving your gray hair uh moon hair is called that i was actually going to me i did have a blog about growing old i called it silver phoenix but i was going to call it moonlight in my hair so this is really well i need to put some more stuff in it um, the thing is, I my hair was grey, I let it go grey, and then I succumbed and I dyed again, but I'm going to go back to letting it go grey. So this is just some food that will help your healthy hair and herbs to support it. And I want to make up a, a hair rinse for here to put in there just to see, just to help because I did follow some ladies on... You have to excuse my nails, actually. I've been tea dyeing paper. Um, <laughs> tangent there. Um, yeah, I was following some ladies on Instagram and YouTube who, you know, have grey hair. Uh, and most of them will say sunlight makes grey hair a bit yellowy. So I want to get a hair rinse, make a hair rinse up that does, helps with that, but, and also, you know, for health reasons so that's as far as i've got so far it's just it's not much i know but i've enjoyed doing it uh, and it's been a nice little distraction from the fact that i've got a new job that i'll be starting soon that i'm kind of excited about but also shit my pants about so yeah fun times so that's just what i've got just now i just thought i'd let people know and i might actually do a sort of grimoire with me next time when I've got the time I'll maybe plan out a page and then just sit and do it on camera okay bye